compacting your dirt inside of your forms and you're using one of these Vibrapack rollers, um, number one, what I always do is I, I take the dirt, I'm gonna spread it out and use a machine right there and I do my best to spread it out as flat as I can. But if you have all these lumps and these bumps, the Viber Pack is gonna want to go and sink itself one side or the other. You're gonna get it pushed up against the form and that's not good. So you wanna take it and you wanna just take your shovel and just spread it out. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just spread it out nice and flat, you know, kind of so that the Viber Pack can just roll right over anything. It's not gonna go left or right and sink down in a little hole and get pushed up against your forms in any way. Um, something else that you need to do is you wanna make sure that your material has moisture in it. Um, if your material is dry, you're not gonna get a good compaction rate. So either it rained a ton last night, so I didn't have to add any moisture to this material, but if it doesn't rain and it's dry material, you'd take a garden hose, take your fire hose, something and spray it down, get it wet, spread the gravel out in your pad, take the hose, spray it down, and then pack your dirt. Um, but yeah, make a little bit of prep, a little bit of extra prep, a little bit of extra time, a little extra work, makes everything go a lot easier and a lot smoother. Bada bing, bada boom, it is that simple guys. We will do that over and over until we reach this level here on our porch. And then inside, we'll do the exact same thing. Stay tuned if you